Jason Lee is one interesting man, and he's a whole lot more than the actor in My Name is Earl and all of those Kevin Smith movies. One of his other passions is photography, and it brought him to the Eastman Museum last night to deliver a talk about his pictures of tattered towns in Texas. Minutes after Lee arrived in Rochester, he chatted with Adam Chodak about that project and its link to Kodak. The first thing I thought of as I looked into your career, how it wasn't fair. You're a professional, or were a professional skateboarder. Yeah. You're a talented actor, and now a recognized photographer. Mm -hmm. It's a lot for one person. <laughs> uh, very grateful, absolutely. Very grateful, yeah. I mean, I, I, think it's, I think it's safe to say that everything came from skateboarding. And it just, it just instills in you this sense of spontaneity. Mm -hmm. And so when I'm road tripping as a photographer now, I'm very much feeling those similar feelings to being younger and, and uh, crammed in a van with a bunch of other skaters touring the country and uh, staying in roadside motels because you're on a budget. So while the mentality is the same, I'm curious to know how you were able to notice the bridge between skateboarding and photography. I had already been acting for about six years but for some reason, I never really paid much attention to sort of what goes on on the other side of, of production. And just one day, I just kind of was just in a daze staring at one of the cameras. And I thought, oh, man, I, yeah, wow, I used to shoot Super 8 film. And what, you know, and then and I was off and running. You use 4x5 Kodak for the most recent project. And for my second. Oklahoma series, I'm also using Kodak 4x5. Yeah. What was it about that that attracted you? Well, I'm using old film. Um, expired film can be kind of interesting. A little fady, a little sort of, a little grittier, a little unpredictable. Going back to skateboarding, we here in Rochester may very well get a skate park pretty oh, soon. Wow. It's a big proposal. It's moving yeah. forward. It okay. seems pretty quickly. Okay. What are the benefits for folks who don't know about skate parks to have one in your city? You have places where kids can now go that maybe uh, don't do the football or the baseball thing or, or whatever, you know. And a lot of people study acting from four years old up. Sure. You were doing skateboarding and you kind of just moved into that and the next thing you know, you're you. Did yeah. you know that that was in you, in a way? Uh, I had a friend that knew a casting director that was casting a Kevin Smith film called Mall Rats, which was his second film. The food corner's downstairs, the cookie stand is upstairs. It's not like we're talking quantum physics here. And somehow I ended up getting the part. And when I got to set and started working, I was apps all the, all the, you know, confidence that maybe I, I had still carried with me from being like a kid who thought he was funny back in school or whatever. All that went out the window because as soon as those cameras started rolling, I completely froze. It was so awkward, but I got through it just like anything that you got to get used to. If you want to see the full 15 minute interview with Jason Lee, along with other really great interviews like this one, head to RochesterFirst.com and just click on the Adam interview section.